take a look at this. No. <clears throat> mean that's enough. I mean, enemy ships are approaching. I don't see anything. I need to save this last one. You're going to endanger the whole mission to save one creature? Just give me a second. This is a waste of time. There is Something's wrong. Cut it loose. We need to retreat before... Attention. Ship is under attack. What happened? Probably one of the enemy vessels I warned you about, remember? We need to get that last creature. Too late. The ship is retreating under autopilot to a safe location. And we're completely locked out of the control. Yeah. How are we going to perform any more rescues? We'll have to find another way to hack into the boom arm controls and another way to bring the shields down at the right time. And who knows if we'll be able to navigate to the right system now that the ship's on high alert. The ship's computer must be freaking out right now. Oh, yes. <laughs> as soon as the alarm sounded, the first thing she probably did was check on you and your... I don't trust the fox guy though. Pulls it off. Ship under attack, everything's fine. Stay on alert. I think there might be food around. Always, sir. Wait, young pup. It is not time to deploy the rescue system yet. Any luck with the ship's controls? No, but we intercepted a new distress signal, this time from Prima Doom. How are we going to get control of the ship's cargo boom arms? We'll need to attempt a manual override. The manual boom yes. arms controls are located here. Attempt a manual override. Here, I've hacked the airlock door so you can now open it without alerting the over mother. How are we going to take down the shields? I have a plan. The shields require so much power, they have a dedicated source. This fusion orb. Take this Omicron inhibitor and place it over the fusion orb. And when the time is right, we'll turn it on and turn off the fusion orb. Along with the ship's shields. Got it. Doesn't sound good. <laughs> the distress call was from Prima Doom? How do we get there? Same as always. Take this star chart to the Space Weaver and hope for the best. So, how long have you been living in here? I am a recent stowaway. I came because I sensed you were ready. Are you really a wolf? No, I wear this disguise to blend in with your other stuffed animal friends. Weird. 
So that's a wolf suit? What are you underneath? <laughs> I am what I do. A rescuer of creatures in need. Just like you. Why do I have to be the one to choose who to rescue? A boy your age just has good instincts for the job. Fucking shifty eyes. Better get back to the mission. Yes. Our window of opportunity won't last forever. <laughs> Alright, let's go to the airlock, I guess. Pardon me on that one. Sneeze was intense. I think I'm going to take a five minute and I will be right back. All right, let's get back to it. Everything's all happy. This is the kitchen or the food place, right? <coughs> Don't you have anything else to do? Just making sure you're safe. 
she'd leave something this dangerous lying around. What's that? Nothing. You got the knife now? Yes. Not going back in there if I can help it. <laughs> Over here. Hey, why won't this open? Oh, honey, you can't come in here. I'm working on a surprise for you. What is it? Nice try. the captain's room. Son, I'm not sure it's safe enough for you to leave your room. I'm tired of being a prisoner in my room. I'm sick of being a prisoner on this ship. I know, son. I know it's hard. <laughs> I've given up so much. Listen, I'd like to tell you a story. A story of another person your age. A young girl. She wanted to live a normal life, but she was chosen. She was honored with a special duty. Some people would call it a sacrifice, but what she didn't realize at the time was that it was a great honor. Please, I've heard the story of the Sacrifice Girl a million times. I know the ending. The Sacrifice Girl is you, right? What I'm trying to tell you is I made a hard choice, but I regret nothing because... Great story, computer. I'm sorry they programmed you with someone's sad memories, but I have to go. You know the truth. Go in here. Can't go in here. All right. What's oh, this dude? All right. That's cool. Don't need to go there yet because I can't do anything else. Um, this door. Elevator down. I'm assuming. Ice cream world. Um, super ever fun time. <laughs> Train world. What's this? Warning. Objects placed into this trash chute will be jettisoned from the ship, and the next time it happens to one of your toys, Shay, your father is not going to retrieve it for you. Crawl into something once when you're two years old and then lock it forever. Uh. Teleporter, activate. May I teleport you to the Nexus? Oh, no. The hell? Think airlock head. Okay, I'm gonna go in the right direction. Little dude's literally welding right there. All right. It's an elevator. Can I go that way? No. That's it. Uh It seems to be doing fine out here in space without air. Or stab it? Oh, I'll stab it. That could create a puncture wound and possibly leak acid blood onto the ship. I eat it. I don't think eating it should be my first step. Damn it. Giving back presents is rude. Open up. <laughs> if it weren't for this stupid air hose, really have some fun up here except for the part where I can't breathe let's see if this fits come on <sighs> that 
that's the stuff. <laughs> if it weren't for this stupid, here we go. Man. But I cut the air hose. Find some sort of propulsion, eh? <laughs> Go see what's in train land. If there's anything in here. Go to this place. Fake controls. What a surprise. Hey, can we run the attack mission protocol? Sure. the distressed vessel friendship circle i found one of the crew <laughs> fake controls what a surprise i wouldn't sit in those beanbag chairs unless they <laughs> cuddle me more fake controls fake fake controls what a surprise what happened here Or did you attack yourselves in a fit of space madness? It was us. Yes. Uh, oh God. This place is awful. Leave. God, dude, allergies are destroying me right now. See if anything's different in ice cream land. Literally not. Uses something like this. It's a whipped cream gum. Found my fucking proposal. Yeah, boy. Don't mind me, I got this. It would make a good jetpack, but I don't really have the vertical clearance in here to make that very fun. Alright. Aha, Rex. I'm free. Get Rex, son. Space. Okay. Now what?
Found the controls. Those must be the manual controls for the boot arms. Those must be the manual controls for the boot. Maybe if I could get this hatch open. No good. Stupid fat hands. Knife. Leave the infinite void of space itself. Rats can't reach. I think I think Gary wants to grab that. Okay, grabbing Gary. It's hero time. Don't be scared. Well, go ahead. Grab the controls. Oh, yeah, I have the button. Engage. Good boy. attention just yet. You sit tight here, push the button again when it's go time, okay? Sweet. Goodbye, Gary. You were the best <laughs> present ever. Alright, now I need to find the Nexus thingy. Take that teleporter there, I guess. Thing on the thing. Turn off shield. That's tiny. Caution. Entering an area of strong Omicron radiation levels. Home radiation shielding necessary to proceed. Of course. Because my head's too soft. Fusion orb without my radiation. God damn it, my head's too small. The Hall of Heroes? Here. The helpless creatures we rescued are being quarantined in there. 
wish I could let them out. But it's for their own safety, I guess. <laughs> Judging by the wolf hair, this must be where Merrick sleeps. Teleporter, activate. May I teleport you to the Nexus? <laughs> there is no time. All right. Now I get to go here. This way to the fusion ore containment facility. Tiny hat again. Almost small enough. Shh, so I need to figure out how to get my head smaller. Teleporter, activate. May I teleport you to the Nexus? Not responsible for lost items, motion sickness, or mutation. Thanks for traveling with us. Go here. Activate. My head will be normal. Yep. Hang on. Hey, my head's back to normal size. That's because you followed the rules and went back through the proper teleporter. I go through this. Go through here. Here. Uh oh. Why you do this sound? Okay, that's that's annoying. Now we're back. I don't know if I've gone through this one. Teleporter, activate. This way to the fusion or containment facility. <laughs> I should have gone to three. My head should be fucking super tiny. I think that's all my head can take. You need to make a return trip through me right away, Shay. In a minute. My head's real tiny you now. I think this machine is just never going to give me a helmet. A little snug, but I think it will work. I'm not sure how long I can stand the spoiled milk smell. That fusion wood powers the ship's shields, which is critical because we get attacked by enemy spaceships constantly. Merrick told me to use this on the fusion wood, not that. <laughs> Easy does it. 